Hello, tech enthusiasts. How are you all doing? Welcome back to Long Switch Academy. This is Shubham, your host, and I'm thrilled to have you here today as we dive into an exciting journey of learning Salesforce Lightning Web Components. Whether you are a returning subscriber or a newcomer, your presence makes this class even more special. This is the episode one of our course on understanding the fundamentals of Salesforce Lightning Web Component. If you haven't subscribed to our channel already then please subscribe to our channel and click the notification bell icon so that you never miss an update from us. Before we dive into the exciting world of Lightning Web Components, LWC, it's essential to ensure that we have the right foundation in place. In this segment, we'll discuss the prerequisites that will set you up for success as you embark on your journey to master LWC. From fundamental web development skills to specific Salesforce knowledge, these prerequisites will empower you to make the most out of your learning experience. Let's explore the key requirements to get started with Lightning Web Components. First and foremost, having a solid foundation in HTML, CSS, and JavaScript is crucial for anyone venturing into Lightning Web Components. These are the core building blocks of web development and understanding how to structure content with HTML, style it with CSS, and add interactivity with JavaScript forms the basis of creating dynamic and engaging user interfaces in LWC. Moving on to the next prerequisite, beyond the syntax of HTML, CSS, and JavaScript, a grasp of fundamental web development concepts is invaluable, understanding the document object model, DOM, event handling, and asynchronous programming is essential when working with the component-based architecture of Lightning Web Components. These concepts form the backbone of creating responsive and interactive user interfaces. Let's check out next prerequisite. Lightning Web Components leverage the modern features introduced in ECMA Script 6 and later versions of JavaScript. Familiarity with ES6 features, such as arrow functions, classes, and modules, enhances code readability and organization. A solid understanding of these modern JavaScript concepts ensures that you can make the most of LWC's capabilities in a clean and efficient manner. Let's take a quick overview of the next prerequisite. While not mandatory, having a basic understanding of the Salesforce platform is advantageous. Concepts like records, objects, fields, and the overall Salesforce data model will provide context as you integrate Lightning Web Components with back-end logic. This knowledge enables you to create custom user interfaces that seamlessly interact with Salesforce data. Let's see what do we have as the next prerequisite. As we embark on the journey of learning Lightning Web Components, LWC, understanding Salesforce development fundamentals is like having a compass to navigate through the Salesforce landscape. These fundamentals provide the essential skills needed to seamlessly integrate dynamic and responsive user interfaces using LWC on the Salesforce Lightning platform. It's about mastering Apex for server-side logic, becoming adept in SoCal to interact with data smartly, and grasping the basics of triggers. This foundation not only enhances the functionality of Lightning Web Components but also equips developers with the know-how to create robust and scalable solutions. In a nutshell, Salesforce development fundamentals form the cornerstone for unlocking the full potential of LWC and building impactful applications on Salesforce. Let's see what do we have as the next prerequisite. Practical experience is key to mastering any technology and this holds true for Lightning Web Components. It's highly recommended to sign up for a Salesforce Developer Edition account. This dedicated environment allows you to experiment, develop, and test your LWC components in a controlled sandbox. It's a hands-on approach that accelerates your learning journey. Let's take a look at the next prerequisite. Using Visual Studio Code with the Salesforce Extension Pack can significantly enhance your development experience. This integrated development environment, IDA, provides features like code completion, syntax highlighting, and integrated debugging tailored specifically for Salesforce development, making your workflow more efficient. Let's take a quick overview of the next prerequisite. Salesforce Trailhead is not just a learning platform. It's your passport to mastering the ins and outs of the Salesforce ecosystem. 
Designed for individuals of all skill levels, Trailhead provides a hands-on, interactive, and gamified approach to learning Salesforce. Whether you are an aspiring developer, administrator, or a seasoned professional, Trailhead offers a diverse array of modules, projects, and trails tailored to your learning objectives. With its engaging content and real-world scenarios, Salesforce Trailhead is not just a learning experience. It's an adventure that propels you toward becoming a Salesforce expert, one trail at a time. Similarly, Trailhead offers a variety of modules and trails specifically designed for Lightning Web Components. These trails can help you with understanding the basic LWC concepts, guide with best practices and provide sample code snippets. Therefore, we suggest you to refer to Trailhead when you embark on your journey to learn Salesforce LWC. Let's see what do we have as the next prerequisite. Salesforce CLI, or Command Line Interface, is the powerhouse tool that empowers developers and administrators to take control of Salesforce operations with efficiency and precision. This command line toolset provides a streamlined way to interact with the Salesforce platform, enabling tasks such as data manipulation, metadata deployment, and code development from the comfort of a terminal or script. Salesforce CLI simplifies complex tasks, accelerates development cycles, and enhances collaboration by allowing users to seamlessly work with version control systems. Whether you are automating processes or building integrations, Salesforce CLI is your go-to companion for a command-driven approach to Salesforce development and administration, bringing flexibility and power to your fingertips. Let's take a look at the last prerequisite. Understanding the basics of version control, particularly using Git and platforms like GitHub, is optional but highly beneficial. Version control helps you track changes in your code, collaborate with others seamlessly, and maintain a structured and organized development workflow. It's a valuable skill that can enhance your efficiency as a developer. Remember that while these are recommended prerequisites, anyone with a solid foundation in web development and a willingness to learn can start exploring and working with Lightning Web Components. Salesforce provides extensive documentation and resources to support developers in their journey with LWC. Thank you so much for joining us today and being a part of our tech community. Your presence and engagement mean the world to us. Subscribe now to learn and grow with us and to stay updated with our latest videos. Your support truly makes a difference. Until next time, happy coding. This is your host Shubham bidding you a bye. Take care.